Hey everybody, this is Firegun522 here with my 14th hammer editor tutorial. And today I'm going to be showing you how to use the clipping tool. And sorry if I'm a little, going a little fast, a little irritated because I've been doing this over and over again. I can't explain it too fast. Okay. So, so clipping is good for speeding up your mapping. I don't mean compiling, I mean like how fast you can make the map. It's good for, um, what's the word I'm looking for? It's good for replacing, replacing Carve, which tutorial 10 I made over Carve, and Carve is just horrible. Shouldn't have made a tutorial over it, but I did. And, um, it's good for making, like, irregular objects match up on it with each other, like a ramp or something. So I'll try to show you three things that it can do, replacing and fixing and all that junk. Alright, go ahead and open up Source SDK. Once you have that open, it's your engine version and your game. It should be every engine that I can think of, except Gold Source, maybe. I don't know. I don't have Half-Life 1. But uh, go ahead and open up Hammer Editor once you have your map open and Hammer. Uh, we can get started. Or if you just want to watch and learn, then be my guest. Alright, so right now I'm just going to make like a giant ass hallway or something thing going on here. Alright, pitch enter, make the giant brush. And so now, with our clipping tool selected, which is this little one right here, with the yellow plane, I'm just going to grab the little top thing, drag it down to the bottom. Of course, you don't have to drag it all the way down, you can just drag it to like a little bit, but I like to have it all the way down. Alright, so I'm going to explain this. The clipping tool, it clips things. It doesn't carve things. It just gets rid of the face that you don't have in white on the grid. So like right here, this gets kept. So like this big part, this yellow part right here, this little part gets deleted. So if I press enter, bye bye little part. Okay. And of course you can change this. Instead of just grabbing it right here and flipping it over, you can be lazy, like me, but I like to be lazy. Grab the, press the clipping tool button again, or press shift X, and it'll change sides. I like pressing shift X, good for carving. Okay, uh, so once you have, I'm just gonna make like a little doorway, and so we need both these sides. Press enter, now we have one right there, but they're separate. And we're gonna grab one right here too. Press enter. Okay, now we have three separate little things. All right, now in our front view over here, or the side, whatever this is, top, this is front. But uh, over here, we're just gonna select the um, the top of it right here, so we don't have the bottom. Press enter, and now we have a doorway. Now with the doorway, I feel like doing something amazing with it, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and clip it some more. Clip. Clip again. Whoops. Made it the wrong way. And of course it could be any way on this little thing, so you can just go from the bottom to top, top to bottom, whatever, as long as you choose the right face that you want to keep. this. Let's make this 45 degrees. That's off grid. Let me just say I want to align it with this down here. Oh, fuck it. Whatever. Um, I don't feel like going into a bunch of this because I only got like 10 minutes to explain it. I've already used up 4 minutes, surprisingly. So yeah, we can clip is good. We can, let's say I wanted to like clip this part to where I don't want the top. Just go up here. And then do the same over here. Oh 
Wait, I got that backwards. So yeah, clipping tool is good for like clipping things over or cutting things out instead of carving. Carving is bad. It's a no-no. Okay, uh, I got another five minutes to kill, so I might as well show you real quick another example. I have this brush. I have another one down here. Let's say this little thing is like a sidewalk or something. I don't know, I'm just coming up with a story real quick to give you all an example. Now, let's say we needed this thing to be a ramp. So we would grab our clipping tool. Now, instead of going all the way down here, we just grab right here, to line it up with that, and then take it up to the top corner. Press Shift Shift X until you like the side that you want. And now we have a little sidewalk ramp thing. All right. So it, it's quick. It's quicker than getting a brush, moving it all the way up here, and then having to grab it and then just align it. Even though I did that fairly quick. Whoa, whoops. Um, okay, but uh, clipping a lot faster and cleaner. And what the hell happened to my grid? There we go. Okay, now here's something that you can't do with carve, and it'd be mess with displacements. So if I just did random noise, let's say like 20 or something. Make my grid bigger. Alright, so now my displacement is right here. I'm going to show you two scenarios and one control of the normal. Alright, so I'm just going to make a block over here that cuts it in half. Or, yeah. Alright, this block is going to be for carve down here. So, Control Shift C. Oh, whoops, that's X. Control Shift C, and it carves it. You can see that it kind of moved. So, here's our carved one. Right here, here's our clipped one. Oh, wait. I want to get rid of the top one. And then here's the normal one. And then you can see that it obviously was this one that kind of kept the original shape more than this one. This one just kind of like jagged all over the place. Okay, well, um, I don't know, I don't really have any more time left. It's already been like eight minutes or so. Well, anyways, um, this has been Firegot 522 with my, uh, what is this, 14th tutorial. Teaching you how to carve, or no, not how to carve, I'm so sorry, how to clip. Um, about the fifth time recording this. Anyways, sorry if I bored y'all to death to tears or whatever with all this, but I had to get my point across that clipping is better than carve and it's just good for all the bunch of shit speeding up your mapping. Anyways, this is FireGut 522, my 14th tutorial, teaching you how to carve. Have fun, don't burn yourself.